Hey guys, welcome back. This is Mary. Uh, today, I'm excited to uh, share with you how I prepped my romaine lettuce seedlings for the garden. So this is what I did. Uh, every time I buy um, lettuce <laughs> for my salad, I would eat the big stalks or the big leaves and then leave the heart, the middle part of the uh, lettuce, okay? And then I soak them in water. I just take a cup and then soak it in water just like this. Okay, so I have a few over here. They are about to root. This one is about to root. Look at that. See that white part over there? Those are the roots coming out. So this is actually ready to be planted. I'll show you the other one. Now this is the first one that I soaked in water. That's why this one actually have roots. I think this is like, uh, I had this in the uh, water for like three weeks. And it got it developed some roots. Oh, um, this one here. Hold on, I'll show you. This one, see? Look at the roots. So this is going to the garden today. Okay, so I have. Let's see, getting them out of the cup now. <laughs> when I soak um, the seedlings. This lettuce seedlings in the uh, water, I use the uh, cup, but it got to be the, the glass ones because I think it keeps the water cool, you know. So here we go. Let me gather them and then I'll bring it to the garden to be planted. Okay. And uh, with this uh, Roman lettuce, romaine lettuce, or any kind of lettuce, they actually like um, uh, cold temperature. So at night, it, it's it's almost the end of April now. I mean, it's the we are in the middle of April, and at night the temperature sometimes falls to uh, 40 degrees or below 40 degrees, but I think it says that they can actually withstand that these are called, uh, lettuces are called uh, hardy frost plants, so they should be fine. So I'm gonna bring this to the garden and plant them, and I should have lettuce in no time. So okay, I'll see you in the garden. I'll also do other things in the garden because uh, it's really, uh, you know, I it got to be done. I have so many things to do in the garden. So, later. Okay, guys, let's plant this uh, romaine lettuce. I have five of them to plant today, so there you go. The soil is nice and soft because it just finished raining. It rained um, this afternoon. Oh, look at the it has a uh, look at the worm. My soil is really good. I have a lot of uh, worm. I have actually I have fertile soil, but I still like to. Uh, Make some compost for my oh no I don't want to kill you. Make compost for my uh, garden. So anyway, here you go. So I make I just make a hole and then put this one in there. Put it and cover it with the soil. There. It's been raining every day, so they will uh, they will root in no time because the root is about to come out. 
I don't have to wait until uh, they root out before I plant them. Okay, one down. Let's do another one. There you go. Look, it's nice. How easy, right? <laughs> that the thing with this is when you plant it like this um, it will give you some new shoots or buds and that's what you're gonna eat this is the second time I'm actually planting my uh, some romaine lettuce like this I also tried to do the um, the one with the head that forms head the um, what they call it is the uh, iceberg lettuce, but that one don't work. When I soak them in water, they rot. But the Roman lettuce was oh look at this, I have a lot of worms. Look at this, my soil is really nice. But this one, see this, this one has uh, roots. And it's gonna, I think it's going to flower, but it's okay. After that, it will give me some new, new buds, you know. So here we go, make it deeper. I don't even have to water them because the, wa the soil is actually uh, still damp, wet from the rain earlier. So there you go. Nice. I'll make more plants when I buy some uh, lettuce. I always leave the uh, the hearts, like I said, the middle part. It wasn't like this when I soaked it in water. It was all white. You know, I just left the little, little, the very little uh, leaves inside. But then after you soak it in water and put it um, where it is sunny, they turn green like this and it opens up. And then it, uh, they uh, give roots out. But uh, like I said, this one's about two roots, so there's no problem. I'm going to plant them and then um, it should root out soon. There, done. Nice. So there you go. And like I said, these are uh, lattices are resilient in uh, with um, cold weather, so they will be fine. See, I have now I have some lettuce says in my garden and also I'd like to uh, bury more of these um, uh, veggie scraps that I have here <laughs> this is my uh, um, the uh, veggie uh, trimmings and fruit peelings that I gathered for the whole week so now I'm going to bury them Oh, I forgot to get my thing. Hang on. I need the... Uh, I need this. Okay. So, here we go. Last time I did this side. See? I put the stick so I know where it is. This one. That. All the way down there. So this time I'm going to do this side. So I just make a hole. Okay, this was from last year. Look at this one. Look how dark this is. Wow. Okay, because this is where I buried the stuff from last year too. It's still here. It looks really good. So I'm gonna going to put more stuff. Some are ra rotten uh, yams, <laughs> yam that I didn't eat, and some uh, some uh, tomatoes because sometimes I would buy a lot and then I don't use them in time and they they uh, get bad. So instead of throwing them away, I make fertilizers out of them.
piece I need. Now I need a stick. I like to put a stick so I know where where to um to plant my thing when June comes. Okay, there you go. Here. Make one here too. See how soft my uh the soil is. Deep enough. Then scoop up. Scoop up some of this. Bury them. Good. Okay. Let me finish doing this, okay? And then uh, I'll show you when everything's done. Okay, guys, I'm done. So now this whole plot has um, uh, fruit and veggie uh, compost. So these are ready when June comes for me to just plant the stuff. I think I'll plant um, uh, peppers over here and some... Uh, gourd i think and they can just i gotta make a pole so they can climb up but uh yes i'm done it rains every day so um they will um uh rot in uh in a short time so see guys i don't i don't waste my um my uh, garbage my food garbage not i mean my uh veggie and uh, fruit peelings and trimmings I don't waste them. I uh, use them as uh, fertilizers. Okay, guys. So, thank you very much for watching. Um, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.